This is our 2000 KX250. So Kawasaki made some great bikes from 99 to 02. They're the same bike pretty much. And uh, they all were just a powerhouse. They just had really good power. So before I thought about doing any kind of YouTube things, I still did bikes. And this is one of the bikes I did. Um, so I figured I got a guy who really wants to buy it. So he's coming to take a look at it tomorrow. So I figured I better shoot some video so you guys can see what it's like. So hopefully you like it. We did a lot of work to this bike. Front and rear wheel bearings, obviously front and rear brakes. It's still got the stock pipe. It was a little rusty, so we took the finish off in the one spot. I was going to strip it, but I thought I better leave this pipe original. Uh, we did the Ricky Carmichael style, you know, Chevy trucks, Kawasaki. It's my age range, so that's why, you know. Uh, brand new chain and sprockets on this one. The exhaust was all repacked. Now, this bike was filthy when we got it. We ended up picking this bike up for a song and a dance. Uh, redid the carb, all the carb lines, everything new clutch cable, new throttle cable. But we'll fire it up here in a second, let you guys see what it's like. New tires again. This is a pretty pristine bike. It, you can tell by the paint on the frame. She hasn't ever had a lot of hours. It wasn't repainted. That's why I picked this bike up. I'll right, we'll try and fire this bike up. Now it hasn't ran or been started. Oh, it's gotta be two months since well before I built the last bike. Hopefully she fires up. So this new microphone that I got is obviously horrible at picking off uh, the sound in the background. So it's really good at keeping the sound from the background away, but the problem is we're not able to hear the bike properly. The bike doesn't really sound like this. You get a better uh, understanding of the sound of the bike when I take it for a ride here, but that's what's going on. The bike doesn't sound that bad. So we ended up getting a new action camera and I've never used one before. So here I am just trying it out for the first time. Obviously I have it a little bit low, but that's good to know for next time. Uh, anyway, guys, I'll let you guys watch. Hard start. She got good compression. to get a look at the old photos of the bike. Uh, I had some before pictures, so this is what it looked like when I got it. I actually washed it in this video, and then 
um, my girlfriend, she's a smart one, said, you got to start taking pictures of all these bikes. So that's what we did. Well, as you guys can see from all the before pictures, what the bike looked like, black, half missing parts, everything. It was just another abused bike. But once we're done with them, they look pretty good and they work good. It ran, uh, it ran good and strong, pulled pretty good. Obviously, I don't have a track here to ride it on. Uh, but I'm, I'm not gonna ride it real hard anyway. This one's, uh, this one's for sale. So it was just a fun one to build. You know, brand new tires. Everything's been done. Spotless in there. You can see motors all completely scrubbed up. <clears throat> just looks really, really good. You know, the rads are good and straight. Just everything looks new. And that's the way that's the way you should be selling a bike, is making it look look new. Anyway, just a simple short video just to show you guys another bike. But if you guys uh, like this kind of thing, leave me a comment. Any questions, I'll be more than willing to answer them.